Hello everyone! In this tutorial we will see how to enable and configure depth of field in Maverick Render. Let's go to the Start window, Additional tab and pick the chest scene. For this scene to show up in your additional tab you will first need to go to our website Resources area, Scenes, scroll down and here it is. You can download it and install it from here. So. Start window, additional tab, chess scene. This scene comes with depth of field pre-enabled. You can tell because the chess pieces at the background are out of focus. But important, depth of field is disabled in Maverick rendered by default. This is to avoid that in scenes with a very small scale everything looks out of focus from the start and this can be very confusing. To enable depth of field Right click on the render and select Disable Global DOF. This is the sharp look that you would get in Maverick by default and to enable DOF just click the same option again. Now, how do we configure the amount of depth of field? Here at the bottom toolbar you can find the camera we are at and by pressing the pencil icon we will reveal the camera attributes in the attribute editor. The attribute that controls depth of field is aperture, also known as f-stop or f-number. The higher the aperture, the sharper the image, and the lower the aperture, the narrower the depth of field. Here's a nice tip. In Maverick you can roll back an attribute to its default value just by right-clicking on the value slider, like so. Keep in mind that Aperture not only controls depth of field, but also the amount of light that is allowed to enter the diaphragm. So why is exposure not being affected here when I change Aperture? Well, this is because of this small lock icon here. Without this option, Aperture would behave just like in a real camera. Raising the Aperture value would close the diaphragm and lower the exposure, and lowering the Aperture would allow more light in. In Maverick, you can get rid of this sometimes unwanted effect with the Aperture Lock icon. A truly remarkable feature in Maverick is how easy it is to define where the camera is focused at. All you have to do is right-click anywhere on the render and select Out of Focus. As simple as that. The point where you clicked will be in focus. Alternatively, you can use a shortcut. Control, Shift and left click. Let's focus on the pawn at the background. Let's focus on the king at the foreground. Everything near the focal plane is in focus and everything away from the focal plane is progressively out of focus. Last, here you can easily configure camera bokeh by selecting a polygonal shape for the camera iris. By default, the iris in Maverick is circular. Depth of field in Maverick cleans really fast and it's a technique that always adds a true-to-life photographic touch to your images, so we encourage you to experiment with it. We hope that you found this tutorial useful and see you in the next one.